There are two bizarre stories I thought you'd like. One of them is 1987. I was long puts on a Friday. I saw the market crashing, uh, which was one of my bear flags. So I just walked away, long puts. There was a guy that was part of the same clearing firm and you go upstairs. There's like an upstairs above the CBOE where there's like a bank of uh, monitors. So you could watch the bid and ask and everything going on. And the guy next to me was massively short strangles and straddles. So he's sitting there chanting hymns and all that, sweating like bullets right next to me. He ended up one of the biggest losers in the crash. He lost $50 million right in front of me. That was pretty bizarre. When he left and Interpol looked for him for five years, his office was covered with police tape. And I'm told uh, people at my clearing firm, when that's taken away, can I have his office? And they're like, sure. So I had that office for like the next six years.